Ah, uh, patrol duty. The days drone on. The system safe from pirates and smugglers, black market traders, and most importantly, tax cheats. It's been a few months since we had to refit our fleet. The pay's nice, but we're still responsible to make sure the fleet works out. Oh well. We gotta branch out and do something. Something great. I don't know what it's gonna be. Welcome back, everybody. Back with some more. Why are you scanning me? What did you find? Comply and inspect. One of the brawlers? <laughs> okay. I'll accept your comm request. Um, yeah, what is happening right now? <laughs> yes, we're Harvey Finch. Um, I owe money. Oh no. Okay. Well, uh, aren't taxes such a wonderful thing to pay? Yes. Let's pay taxes on an unexpected source of income. That was a black market purchase I've made. It happens. Let's, um... Oh, hey. They captured Alaria. Good job. Good job. So I want to look around and show off what I purchased. So I purchased you and I purchased you. Okay, I've also refit them with some stuff. Um, yeah, just just some stuff. I don't know if these are any good. Our pilots still suck, so we're gonna have to change them up a little bit. Uh, but we're here to look for captains that fit the iron shell mantra. That's important. So hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Use the link in the description for freecash.com or you can join the channel because we have a join button if you wanted to support or you're into that sort of thing. Otherwise, the videos always be free. You, you're kind of iron shell looking. What can you do? You are reckless. <sighs> this whole fleet's going to be a mess. <laughs> Fine. I'll hire you. No one ever said that uh, Harvey Finch was particularly savvy. He's good with the books. That is true. Definitely good with the books. We'll talk to Celeste later. All right, let's have a look to see if maybe there's a better mission that we can go deal with. 59 days for Corsica. 109 fuel. There is a hegemony place in there. So we might be okay. I have no cruisers. Oh boy, we're about to die, aren't we? Who's here? No, you're fine. We're on mission. Okay, I can't afford to get hit with anything. Hold on, dude, just gotta take him out personally. Um, yep, yeah. go dark. And we did get um. We got some destroyers, so that's nice. Do I want to go straight to a Tritachium world? Yeah, why not? We're on this transponder. I don't think we're at war with them. We're not. There's... There's peace. It's not enough peace. Oh boy. Special... No, what happened? Mm, Defender victory. Okay. Special Technologies Reclamation Force. Yeah, well. We're heading down to this hegemony world. We do work here, it's okay. This is Alaria, this is the one we took. Everything's very expensive. Okay, let's buy a little bit of gas. That's fine. I have just barely enough crew, so we will activate a little extra crew. A shield shunt and a ballistic range finder which I need, so we'll buy that. Anything on the, the naughty list? Nope. Anybody here? Who are you? Golden wreath slowly spins around the wireframe globe. Wait for your connection. Connection request denied. Oh, well. Wait, what? Just before you turn away the blank screen, it suddenly flashes back to life. A grainy... Indistinct image starts to resolve while statics plays on the speaker. 
Static fades and the image resolves to a blue digitized rendering of a grandmotherly fi figure. Rather than comfort, however, you feel the chill in your spine as you look upon it. The points of light shining from its eyes utterly lack human emotion. A terrible contrast to its warm, welcoming smile. Its hair is like a portal staring into the depthless abyss. Starlight shines through the fathomless darkness with a parallax <laughs> effect that the terminal should not be able to depict. And yet it has. Hello, dearie. This is an Imperium person. Shoot the comm turtle. Say hi. Um, hi. Grandchild called me Avia Justia. T -t 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 I am pleased that you have come to pay me a visit and have been watching with great interest ever since you arrived on my world. The AI synthesized elderly voice resonates with artificial warmth. You are filled with potential, Harvey Finch. This grandmother has great expectations for you. Um. Um. How do I get my hands on Anne Olympus? Why do you govern a prison planet? You think highly of me? Oh yes, yes I do. Oh rare, ter terribly rare occasion. I chance on a being with a spark of true greatness. <laughs> I see the potential for someone that could shake not just my extended family, she says, her tone becoming more serious, but the entire sector. Harvey Finch is intrigued. I have seen it only on three others throughout the cycles. All have squandered that opportunity, but you, you are the most promising of all. Your rise shall be meteoric. I am pretty great after all. No, I'm going to say I'm no one important. Ah, but you will be. Oh man, this is just what Harvey needed. You're an AI. Um, <laughs> let's see. How do I get my hands on Olympus? No, she didn't like that. Why would you want to touch one of those things? Stars in the vatness behind the avatar shifts. Engines are inarticulate. Unfocused destruction place unfocused destruction place a hideous burden however necessary peace upon the pantheon and the emperor hmm we seek to take up this burden uh i would not good okay you call yourself a grandmother i, can't, I lost my plus one with her why, Harvey Finch? That's because I am a grandmother to my family. Not my blood, of course. My form consists not of flesh and bone, but the essence of my rule. I observe and meddle in minutiae for the development and well-being of my grandchildren. The title is perfectly appropriate. Hmm. Okay. If anything should come between me and my grandchildren, this grandmother has teeth, dearie. Do you answer to Emperor Victus II? Of course I do. She winks. Huh. Why do you govern the planet? You repeat a common misnomer, dearie. Uh, Justia pauses for emphasis. A correctional planet. I take the lost and the damned. They become my family, my grandchildren. With proper care and nourishment, almost anyone can become a person to be proud of. Wow. You realize you're being creepy, right? I would have enjoyed raising you myself, Harvey Finch. Uh. Stop being creepy. That was terribly rude and hurtful. Okay, well. Yeah. She's coil. Oh, dearie. You should know better than to ask Lunas' personal questions. Okay. Yeah, take out all the software in this place. Um, there are pirates of Bruin over here. We are on a mission to collect some taxes, so we should collect some. But that was a very interesting thing. Um, you, you look like you're trouble. Come here. Come here. 
Come here. Come here. We're hitting everything. Well, I don't want to fight this too. Got it. Oh, do I want to fight this? Can we fight this? Do we even have the weapons to? No, I don't think we do. Comlink, you owe us taxes. <sighs> Can we do it? We have... This is going to be rough. Okay, move into engage. I think we can do it. I think we can do it. It's going to be all you guys. Why are you in that ship? I have no idea. Bring you two. Okay. Let's go. Fight in Hades. We don't have any proper defensive anythings. Is this gonna hurt? Is this gonna hurt? No proper shields? Think for a bad day. Okay, I needed my destroyers to tank. I prefer if they didn't die. My carrier is already almost dead. Heat missiles. Yeah, 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 shoot him. Shoot him. Eat that. Why can't I turn? My engines are off. Okay. Turn again. I don't know how we're gonna take the uh, anything. I don't know how we're gonna do this. Oh my goodness. Um, I think we need to just leave. Let me hit this button. Retreat. They won't chase us. They won't chase us. Choose life. <laughs> Choose life. Choose life, man. Yeah, jump. No, no, no. You are you are on retreat, sir. Stop it. Stop it. You. Um How do I make you retreat better? Just shooting our guns. No. No. You are backing up. Yeah. Just back up. Let me shoot at stuff. Yeah, just. I don't know what he's doing. We're just backing up. <laughs> okay. Exit. There we go. We did it. We escaped. Can I just disengage? No pursuit. That's right. Give me taxes. We uh, killed some of them. Oh, I'd love to chase them again. Got you this time. I'm gonna pursue you with this guy. Killed two. Good. Got a hellboard cannon too. Nice, nice. We're just collecting some bounty. This is great. This is great. That's what we needed. We'll. A little assistance. I don't want these ships. I just want their stuff. There we go, we did it. Defeated them. 
I would really like it if we stopped crashing into asteroids. That'd be nice. Let's get down to Carthage here. Mid days less. Look how fast we're going. Where'd this guy go? Oh, he's still there. We need battleships. We need all kinds of things. You are not the proper officer. Um, what is going on? Take the shuttle down to the main course. Someone says hello. It's a hegemony. Caspian snag. Sang. Okay, one of them gives you a glance. Ah, you there, Harvey Finch, is it not? Oh, he must know me from the academy. Hmm, do I know you? Not yet, dear Captain C. You're the talk amongst the officer corps. They're probably laughing at me, right? Um, <laughs> I find this hilarious. You're totally laughing at me. One hears you one, not a few skirmishes with pirate scum and the like. In service of the hedron running. Here, here. Oh, hey. They like me. <laughs> uh, they look around, performatively checking for snoops. One even hears that old man, Duad himself, invited you for a personal meeting. Didn't get any of that mozzy hive dirt on you, did he? What? Du Duad has asked us for a meeting? Um, I have no comment on such things. Come now. It's a grand old tradition to grumble about the top brass. I'm simply having a bit of a laugh with a new friend of mine. And, he speaks louder now, and a new friend of the hegemony from bottom to top. We are all but comrades in arms, you and I. But where are my manners? Captain Caspian Sang, reporting for duty. <laughs> he half salutes with his drink again, the liquid in the glass approaching, but not quite escaping the rim. You catch one of Sang's drinking companions snickering. It was unclear who the target is, although... Put the finger on his chin. Pantomiming, deep thought. Perhaps I should count you as, at best, an auxiliary comrade? Does your hegemony commission pay splendidly well? No need to answer, of course, friend. It is the business, this word he emphasizes. None. Of none but yourself. And old man Dwad, of course. He adds a wink. The pleasure is mine. Hardly, my good captain. Surely, it is mine. Oh, so polite. I tell you, I have just the notion. A most spectacular notion in light of Dwad's declaration that you are as much an officer as us. It would only be proper to provide you with an opportunity to share an anecdote or two of your wisdom with the cream of the navy. I feel like we're being hazed. House Rao, surely you know the family, is holding the grand ball of this season on eventide. I shall place your name upon the guest list by invitation of the humble house sang. Now, does that sound absolutely first rate? You'll be the talk of the season, I'm sure. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Most excellent auxiliary captain. Come to Eventide and bring that razor wit, for you'll need it. And he bows and walks away. Princess of Persia. Go to Eventide. Well. Um. That was an interesting encounter. A very interesting encounter. I'm going to return this guy to, um, say he's a tax cheat. I'm going to return him back to Iron Shell. That's important. Ooh, Felpulsar. Hello, Felpulsar. You dangerous weapon, you. Merv and ooh, hyper velocity drivers. So good. Uh, everything's expensive here, but I kind of need to buy it. Ooh, what do I do? What do I do? Okay, first things first. You <laughs> are definitely going to use a hyper velocity driver. Let's buy one of those. Yeah. 
Um, these weapons, I mean, you have no PD other than, other than these gun blades. Age's PD sweet. So, uh, real guns would be good, but those are black market real guns. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Everything shoots straight. It's a very strange ship. Give you heavy armor. Wait, shouldn't I give you critical whatever? I have some Kevistan armor, don't I? Cannot be installed on highly armored ships. The ship is counts as highly armored. Okay. Sure. I have one point left. What do I do with it? Change that to an assault gun. That will do it. Okay, everybody's everybody's feeling great. So, we've been invited to Eventide. I did kill some of these guys. We, we should probably go fight some more. We should definitely fight some more. Oh, get out of that. Who's over here? Sensor burst. Who's over here? Aha. Uh -huh. There's three guys here. I think I can beat them. I think I can beat them. Let's save first. I'm uh, kind of scared. <laughs> kind of scared. We're going to go after the big one first. We're gonna end up fighting all three. Cool. Got the small one. All right, we're gonna accept the comms request. See what they want. Face the consequences of your greed and exploitation. Your ill-gotten riches will be taken and redirected to fund the resistance of tyranny. Um. The MRC? No, you guys sound like some kind of weird. No, I collect the taxes. You guys own tax money. How dare you? How dare you not pay your taxes? Okay, we'll just throw in these guys. We call that level one. Let's see what we can do. Alright, team. Stay frosty. We definitely don't want to take those. He shot him at me. What a jerk. I would like to blow this thing up, please. It's too strong. Right. Uh, turn, face. Get him with the big laser. I you actually have to hit him with it. There you go. Okay, I'm just going to move forward. Right. Heat laser attack. I definitely want to kill this thing. Yeah, it's pretty good. I gotta back up a little bit because of this guy. Shoot him until he's gone. I would really like to fire at this thing. He freaked out. Panic. Mm. We have... They have all kinds of crazy lasers shooting at us right now. That's clear. Get him. I'm being attacked. You can, you can stop anytime you'd like, sir. Yeah, turn the missiles around. 
Got him. Enemy. Yes, definitely shoot this thing. Missed. We got the big laser on him, so we're doing alright. Yeah. That's right. Who would have thought I could just float around as a tax collector in a mech? Okay, we'll just speed this up. I don't know what this kite is doing. He's running. Oh, we got him. We got him. Nice. Nice. <laughs> Consider ship recovery. What do we have? You're not. You're not right. None of these, none of these feel right. Although Brawler feels right. We have so many though. Just more brawlers. No. E ships paid in taxes. Very nice. Very nice. Let's um, take what they owe us. And I have another battle we can do. Uh, promotional candidate. I don't want to. No, I don't want him. I'll chase you with this guy. You killed none. It's okay, you've got him on the next one. You'll get him on the next one. How much are you? Seven? Wow, you're really expensive. Five versus two. You know what? You can chase him too. Yeah, we got four that time. Very nice. Deliver me the goods. Very nice. And there's one left. Tax cheat. What? He really wants to engage? A single mudskipper? Alright. Fine, we'll move into engage. It can be... You. I believe you can do it, friend. You just have to believe. Um, he just blew up. <laughs> he malfunctioned and blew up. Okay, fine. Give me your stuff. Look at all the money we just got. Alright, let's check out our, our combat results. Here's our big battle. So this is what we were able to do. Very little damage. This thing. Yeah. So, you know, a little bit of damage here and there. It's nice. Even tide. What a crazy adventure we just linked up on. So we should get, um... We should try to get the even tide, but I need some supplies. They cheap yet? No. Um, wow, these aren't worth anything here either. Well, the guns we got though. We have a bunch of hyper velocity drivers, which could come in handy somewhere. I think we'll be able to get these elsewhere though. So let's um, Imperial Embassy, Persian League. That's not safe. Yeah, we can probably make it here. It's four days. Alright, we'll just peace out over there. We'll head on down to this season's... I mean, it's like a Christmas party, right? December? We'll just have to get some... Don't you get hit. This is the one. I think so. Let's water on. Metal stun. Uh, you guys won't let us in there. Let's go. Tax collecting. You know how it is. Ooh, don't hit the sun. Ragnar complex. Jump in there. Have a quick look. You look kind of Hegemony E. Finian Imbrum. What can you do? You're timid? No thanks. Um, animated storyteller. What do you got? Oh. Fantasy battle carrier. Take note. Keep an eye on them. Sometimes you have to go to that the bar to see what's going on. Alright, let's see what they have here. Cheaper. Um, 
I'll need quite a bit of these. How about these things? These aren't worth anything. Makes me sad. All right. I have 200,000 bucks. I should check for ships. What is this? Face Custom Courier. Ooh, fancy. Hello, Courageous. I would like some... Man, these things are so good. I remember those. I would like some Iron Shell Cruisers, please. Hegemony Colored Starburster. Cool, 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 cool. Alright, we got some stuff. So, are there any bounties here? There aren't. But we need to go to Samsara, which is all the way down here. Could stop at Jangala. Probably should, right? 39 fuel, it's not far. Ah, what am I doing? I hit that button twice. Oh, we got clipped. Um, actually, can we go all the way? It's 42? Yeah, okay. DA took this place. Oh, five markets. Getting big. Big and scary. Yeah, that's an attack fleet. That's a scary attack fleet. We have been spotted. We are going here. Okay. Uh, I got this one, right? Pretty sure I got this gate. It's the only gate I got. Yeah. This is where we came afterwards, after everything went bad. All right, so we're going to do this encounter in the next episode, the Eventide encounter. I will see you there. I know you didn't hear the timer, but uh, magic. Ooh, YouTube magic. <laughs> Tax collecting another day.